Dear students, let me present to you an example to explain the concept of the support of a continuous random vector. Let us take that situation when we have two random variables, x1 and x2, each of which is of the continuous type. Students, in this case, the support of the probability density function given by small f of x1, x2 is the region of the plane that contains all the points small x1, x2 for which f of x1, x2 is greater than 0. This plane, jo hai, ye sa plane hai? Isko ab is tarah conceive plane, conceive that you have, for example, a room and the room has a floor and the room has walls. Oh, and of course, that has a roof also, but for our purpose, just concentrate on the floor and also the axis that is going upward. So, this floor is the floor variables ko x or y kahin, so then we'll simply say the x y floor lekin agar humne x1 x2 kaha hai then we can say x1 x2 floor is plane ye ek plane hai is plane ka wo ilaqa jiske upar wo surface hai jise small f of x1 x2 say represent kiya ja raha hai aur jiske uh, under the total volume under that surface above that rectangular region or whatever region it is, uh, that total volume has to be equal to 1. So let me come to the simple example. Aap kahenge ki ye to belke complicate ho gaya. Actually, as soon as you see a diagram that is now coming up, you will find that all of this is actually quite simple. The example is very simple. Let us consider the bivariate uniform distribution rather than any other. The simplest one, the bivariate uniform distribution given by f of x1, x2 is equal to 1 where x1 itself is going from 0 to 1 and x2 also is going from 0 to 1 and f of x1 x2 is equal to 0 elsewhere. Ab ye jo mene aapke saamne distribution rakhi hai. Aap note kare ke as you can now see in the diagram it is simply like a, we can say like a box. Ek dabbe ki tarah ki cheez hai. Jis me gaur se dekhe ke x1 jo axis floor ke upar jo x1 axis hai. Hamara jo ye box hai that is starting from x1 equal to 0 and going up to x1 equal to 1. Just concentrate on that particular axis which is being represented by x1. Similarly, if you now concentrate on the other axis, which is being represented by x2, you can see that for that also, the box, the box noma cheese hai, that is starting from x2 equal to 0 and going up to x2 equal to 1. Last but not the least, Please note that the height of this box is also equal to 1. Because if you look this vertical axis, that is also up to 1. Now, when its height is 1, its length is 1, and its width is 1. So volume kisi bhi is tarah ki cheez ka volume kya hota hai? It is the product of the height into the length into the breadth 
or the width. So 1 into 1 into 1 is equal to 1. So the total volume of this box is equal to 1. So this is how you can understand that whenever you have a bivariate situation where the individual random variables are continuous, you will have a floor and on, in some region of that floor, on top of that region, you will have a surface which in this particular example is flat. You just go my box carry. Actually, um closed box na conceive uski jo top hai, that top that in this case is flat because it is a bivariate uniform distribution. Look, if flat bhi agar hai na, even then it is a surface because surface, surfaces can be curved but then you can also have a flat surface. The total volume under the surface in your domain or on the top of the support of your random vector will always be equal to 